Hey, what's going on guys? Got a bunch more training clips here for you. Just wanted to keep you up to date on my progress and everything in the gym. Everything's been feeling really good. I'm sure you guys remember that torn labrum injury that I had. And after a few weeks of doing physical therapy, which I've still been doing, it's been about eight weeks since the actual injury itself, maybe even longer now. But uh, I've been doing physical therapy, really working on my rotator cuff and all those stabilizer muscles. And my bench has actually gotten stronger than it was before right here is my first workout on the new program that i got from my coach greg farris with myobrain i really recommend you guys check him out my lifts have been shooting up his programming is so good and it's like just things that i would never think of doing myself it's a dup program so every day like my lifts are the rep ranges are completely different so it really helps training in different rep ranges at least i found for myself and it just has really helped add weight to my like one, two, and three rep max lifts. So this is the first week of this program. It's called Blue Eyes that he came up with himself. So I recommend you guys check that out. Check out his website. I'll put a link to his website and everything and his uh, YouTube channel in, in the description box of the video. But uh, the first few workouts of this uh, Blue Eyes program were three rep maxes. I don't want to get too much into uh, how he breaks down the program since it's technically his intellectual property and I don't want to just give away that information. But like I said, check him out, send him some emails, talk to him and see uh, if you guys uh, want to start working with him. I really recommend that his pricing really isn't that bad at all. He's a graduate student so he's really up to date with the new scientific literature and everything and really trying to keep everything as simple as possible but make it efficient so you can make some pretty good gains in the gym so uh everything's been feeling good this is 495 for a triple here for deadlifts this is my first time working with five plates on each side since before prep so really happy with that my form probably could have been better it was a little heavy on my back and everything but been doing a lot of accessories to uh help my back and everything stay straighter during those uh heavier deadlifts here is uh, touch and go bench day this was 275 for five reps like I said my bench has really been shooting up between finally eating more and doing the physical therapy on my shoulder it's really just helped my bench so much it's crazy my bench is stronger now than it was before I hurt myself which sounds pretty weird but uh, all that physical therapy has really been helping I do a lot of other accessories on these days most of my training is pretty much full body every day five days a week some days are more specific to like lower body or upper body but most a few probably two or three of the days a week are full body workouts which i've really been enjoying and i just take a day off or two whenever i feel like it as long as i get in those five days throughout the week this was another squat day this was the last uh squat day of week one for me on this program and pretty happy with my form my hips and everything come up a little bit in the beginning of the lift. My elbows shoot up, but besides that, everything's really comfortable. Hit 365 here for a set of five. Pretty slow rep, but grinded that out, and I was really happy with that and hoping to progress on that in the upcoming weeks. Here was one of my back offsets. Typically what I do is I'll hit the prescribed rep range for that day at a top set, and then I'll drop the weight down anywhere from usually about 5 to 10% and then hit some back offsets. This actually wasn't a back offset, this was a pause squat. I was doing uh, two sets of two reps, I hit 325 for that. I feel like that's really helped my squat lately, trying to be a little more explosive out of the hole and been liking doing those, just a different way to train the muscles to contribute to progressing in my squat. Here was some deadlifts. This was uh, the third workout of week two. The first two workouts, I didn't bring my camera. That was a bench and squat workout. But the volume on those days was insane. It was a bunch of sets of four. And then if the volume was crazy. It was a bunch of sets of four, a top set, a few back off sets, and then two AMRAP sets at, I think, 10% less than the weight that I was working with. So this uh, week two of Blue Eyes is probably the highest volume week of training I've ever done in my entire life. But definitely helps when it comes to making progress especially when you're hitting only about two or three rep maxes the following week so the volume decreases a lot 
And uh, this, like I said, was the third workout of the week. Deadlifts, I hit 475 for five reps. Form probably could have been a little bit better, but overall I was pretty happy with it. Here was one of the back offsets. I sped it up just because it was a little bit slow. And this was 450, so that was about a 5% drop in weight. And hit that again for another five reps, and I did two sets of those. Here's my last uh, workout, last training session of, I think this was my last training session of week two. And this was a uh, eight rep max for touch and go bench. I do a lot of pausing, uh, a lot of benching pause, but now I've also been doing a lot of touch and go work also. And this is 260 for eight, which I was really happy with. Grinded out some of those last few reps. I think my mom actually walked over to maybe grab the bar for me if I needed some help, but was happy that I was able to grind those last few reps out. The last workout of week two was actually actually a squat workout. It was a, going for an eight rep max, and I ended up hitting 350 for eight reps, which I was really happy about that I didn't get a chance to record. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and comment. I'm sorry that Frank and I haven't been getting too much good footage up lately. We've both been really busy. But like I said, hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm should have some another video up within the next week and that'll be some heavy two rep maxes on squat bench and deadlifts so i'll see you guys in the next video